When a couple adopts a baby, it's a really kind thing to do for a child who needs a loving home. So when a couple adopted a black baby, they were really excited about becoming parents. But after five years, they got a surprising phone call that completely changed their lives. In their big house, Joseph and Shauna were having a really tough time. They both felt very upset and frustrated. They'd been trying for almost two years to have a baby, but it just wasn't happening. Shauna, why is this happening? We tried everything, Joseph said, feeling really sad. We should have a child by now. Why can't we? Shauna was close to tears. I don't know, Joseph. I don't understand why it's not working. Every month feels like we're losing hope. They both felt really down because they couldn't have a baby. It was like their dreams were falling apart and they didn't know what to do about it. This problem of not being able to have a child was causing them a lot of pain and making them face a really tough situation. As they grappled with their inability to conceive, Joseph and Shauna decided to seek help. They went to see a doctor, hoping for answers. Joseph and Shauna received perplexing news. They were both in good health and there seemed to be no medical reason for their struggle to conceive. The doctors' advice to keep trying naturally left them feeling utterly frustrated and lost. But even after following all the advice, months passed without any good news. It's like chasing a mirage, Joseph, Shauna said, her voice tinged with anger. We're doing everything right, and yet nothing's happening. How much longer do we keep waiting? Joseph echoed her frustration, his face mirroring a mixture of confusion and helplessness. I don't understand it either, Shauna. It feels like we're trapped in an endless cycle of disappointment. They couldn't figure out why they were having trouble having a baby, and it made them feel really upset and lost. Even though the doctors said they were okay, it didn't make them feel better. It just made their feelings of frustration and confusion worse as they tried to understand why they couldn't have a child. One time, their tension had reached an unbreakable peak. Their emotions were raw, and the strain of their inability to conceive had created an almost insurmountable divide between them. In a heated exchange, Shana's voice crackled with anguish. Maybe this isn't meant to be, Joseph. Maybe we're not supposed to be together. Joseph, feeling a surge of desperation and heartache, responded, Can't accept that, Shana. But I don't know how to fix this. Their inability to have a baby put a lot of strain on their relationship, almost making it fall apart. It was really hard for them because they wanted a child so much and it felt like this problem was tearing them apart. They were facing a tough choice that could completely change their lives. This struggle became a turning point for them. They felt so disappointed and sad. It made them think about other things they could do. This difficult time pushed them to start looking for different ways to make their dream of having a family come true. Even though Joseph and Shauna thought about adopting a child, they felt unsure. They worried about what other people might think about adoption. The idea of adopting seemed complicated and brought up lots of feelings for them. They weren't sure if they could handle all the emotion and difficulties that might come with adopting a child. Despite their initial hesitations and uncertainties, Joseph and Shauna delved into the adoption process. Their journey led them to encounter Milo, a delightful black toddler nearing his second birthday. Learning about Milo's story touched their hearts deeply. The circumstances surrounding Milo's availability for adoption revealed a touching desire from his mother, a wish for her son to have stability and nurturing care. Her uncertainty about the father's identity reflected her sincere concern for Milo's well-being. Joseph and Shauna understood and felt deeply touched by her caring wish for Milo. Milo's story seemed to bridge the gap of their doubts about adoption. His need for a loving and stable home, combined with his mother's genuine wish for his future, struck a chord within Joseph and Shauna, nudging them closer toward embracing the idea of becoming Milo's parents. When Joseph and Shauna met Milo, they felt a strong connection with him. Even though they were different from each other, they both understood how much love and care Milo needed. So without any doubts, they quickly applied to adopt Milo. They were really excited about the idea of having him become part of their family. Their joy knew no bounds when news of their successful adoption application arrived. Joseph and Shana were really happy and excited. They got everything ready for when Milo would come, imagining a life together full of laughter and love for each other. However, right when they were most excited, something unexpected happened that could mess up their plans. A surprise was coming that might change things making it uncertain if Milo could join Joseph and Shauna as planned. Their happiness about adopting Milo was suddenly mixed with an incredible surprise. Shauna found out she was going to have a baby, which was unexpected. This news was amazing and hard to believe. 
It brought a lot of happiness, making them forget their past troubles with having a baby. It felt like a miracle and made them really excited for the future. Many people might have changed their minds when something unexpected like this happened, but Joseph and Shana stayed determined. Instead of changing their plans, they accepted this surprising change. Going from expecting just one child to maybe having two made them incredibly happy. Even though it was surprising at first, their hearts were filled with so much joy that it overcame any shock or surprise they felt. Even though they were going to have a baby of their own, Joseph and Shana were still committed to adopting Milo. They were really happy about becoming parents, both through adoption and having their own baby. They were excited about the journey ahead and felt ready for the new experiences of being parents. Joseph and Shana had lots of different feelings when they went from getting ready to adopt Milo to getting really excited about having their own baby. This surprising change in their plans brought them a lot of hope and made them really happy about becoming parents. Joseph and Shana were about to start a whole new life. They were going to have a baby of their own, and they already loved Milo, whom they had adopted. It felt like they were on the edge of making the life they always wanted for their family. After 18 months, something big changed for Joseph and Shana. They became parents of two kids, Milo and Nash. This made them feel really happy and gave them a strong start in their journey as great parents. Even though they didn't have much experience, Joseph and Shana did a really good job taking care of their two boys. When Milo arrived on a plane and Nash was born in a hospital around the same time, their life got really busy. They had to learn how to look after a new baby while also taking care of another active toddler. Their days were full of different feelings like happiness, sadness and celebrating important moments. It showed how committed and good they were as parents. In their busy lives, Joseph and Shauna figured out how to take care of Milo and Nash in a way that made them both happy and healthy. They made a home where both children grew up feeling loved and supported. Milo, he was kind of the perfect first child, Shauna told Good Morning America. He was our entire world. I can't explain what he's done for our lives. And Nash's exuberance and fun keeps us on our toes. Sure, we sometimes get some funny looks, having a black child and a white child, said Joseph. But we don't care. Milo is as much part of our family as if we had given birth to him naturally. Just because he was adopted doesn't mean he's any less of a person. Milo took care of his baby brother Nash like he was born to do it. Even though Nash couldn't talk or walk yet, Milo spent a lot of time playing and being with him. Seeing this made Joseph and Shauna feel really happy and warm inside. Adopting Milo was a big and really satisfying decision for them. When Nash came along naturally, it made their family even better and completed their dreams of having a family. Out of nowhere, their peaceful life was interrupted by an unexpected phone call, shaking things up for Joseph and Shauna. This call disrupted their calm and happy routine, making things feel not so perfect anymore. They weren't sure how the sudden change would affect their family. It made them worried if it would make their family stronger or cause problems that would unsettle the peace they had worked so hard to create. They felt uncertain and worried, wondering if their family's stability would stay strong or if things might start to feel shaky. The biological mom of Milo surprised Joseph and Shauna by getting in touch, revealing her pregnancy and the imminent arrival of a baby girl. She extended an astounding offer to Joseph and Shauna, proposing the adoption of the newborn. This revelation landed like a thunderbolt, leaving the couple astounded and speechless. This unexpected chance was a big deal that needed a lot of thinking. Joseph and Shauna had to really think hard about what to do because the baby was coming in just a month. They felt excited about the idea of having another child, but also had to think about how to manage things quickly. It was a very important decision, and they had to make up their minds quickly because time was running out. The seriousness of this choice was heavy on their minds, pushing them to make a decision as soon as possible. As the days passed before the baby's arrival, Joseph and Shana felt lots of different feelings. Hope, excitement, and a bit of worry too. They were really excited about having a new family member, but everything happened suddenly made them think a lot and ask many questions about what was going to happen next. After thinking a lot, the couple decided that bringing the baby girl into their family was the best thing to do. They wanted to make their family feel complete by giving Nash another sibling to love. It also helped Milo to be close to his biological sister, Oni. Just as Joseph and Shana were excited about bringing Milo's sister, Oni, into their family, something went wrong. There was a big mistake in the papers for Ani's adoption. It seemed like some important information got mixed up or lost, 
making it uncertain if they could adopt her. This problem came up right after their decision to adopt Ani. It made things really complicated and made Joseph and Shana worry a lot about whether they could really bring Ani home or not. The problem with Ani's adoption made Joseph and Shana really unsure. They started having doubts about their decision. They started having arguments because they didn't know if they could bring Ani home anymore. Shana was worried and upset about the whole situation, while Joseph felt frustrated and unsure about what to do next. Their disagreement made things really tense between them for a while, because they didn't know how to solve this problem. But then, after lots of worries and sleepless nights, good news finally came for Joseph and Shana. They found out that the mistake in Ani's adoption was fixed. This made them feel so relieved and happy, because it meant they could bring Ani into their family. Everything got sorted out, and now they were getting everything ready for Ani to come home. Joseph and Shana felt so much joy and relief knowing that everything was okay now. When Ani joined their family, everything just felt right. Like she was the missing part they didn't know they needed. Having Ani with them meant a lot because it matched their dream of having a complete family. Even though it was different, it was really special and important to Joseph and Shana. I felt very grateful that she would give us the opportunity to also parent one of Milo's siblings, Shana said. I think how courageous their birth mom was to recognize that her children needed something more than she could give them. She was very selfless in what she did. I'm thankful every single day that she chose us and felt like we'd be good parents. What do you think about this amazing story? If you were in Joseph or Shana's place, what would you have done? Would you have decided to bring Milo's sister into your family or would you have said no? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below.